The Sunday Mass to me is where everything from the week kind of flows towards and everything for the next week flows from for healing, for strength, for mercy, for forgiveness, and for love. When I hit the church doors, I make it a conscious effort to say now I am entering into a place in which I can drop my guard on everything, especially then when I dip my hand into the holy water to bless myself. I think in the Latino culture, the Sunday Mass is really a, a time of community get-together. It's a reinforcement of, of values and, and families coming together to celebrate God in their life, uh, celebrate uh, the presence of Christ. Well, Sunday Mass for me uh, means family, means a day of just coming here, feeling like you're welcome, feeling loved, feeling a sense of like you belong here. Coming here every Sunday and experiencing the Eucharist uh, in a sense really grounds me and kind of makes me feel like I am connecting to my family even though they are um, several states away. For families, I would hope that going to Mass on Sunday is an opportunity for their family to grow in faith, for parents to model what it means to be a participative Catholic Christian. I identify myself as Catholic. I've always thought of myself as Catholic. And so part of that is an obligation to attend Mass and, and especially having three children to, to model the importance of that to my children. It was part of me is growing up and, and it's part of what I'm handing down to my children as, as, a, as a parent, a father. To the community, first the church here is a safe haven itself for them. They feel, they feel welcomed. But Sunday Mass to them is a place where you leave all your problems behind and you focus on becoming better. The part that I love about Mass is that it's like a, a long prayer. The whole thing is a prayer to God, and, and I feel so thankful afterwards that um, I'm able to be brothers and sisters with uh, one billion people in the world every Sunday. My favorite part would, would be the homily. It takes our tenets, our beliefs, as Catholics and incorporates it with our tradition, our 2,000 years of tradition and our culture in a way that we can understand it so that we come together as one and we're not doing this on our own. I like the Our Father. Being able to pray with uplifted hands as a community really does something for me. My favorite part about Sunday Mass is the music. We have marimba here, along with other instruments, but not only the marimba, but everyone here knows the songs. It's not one of those quiet Masses you hear, it's full of life. The significance of the Sunday Mass for me is, you know, being able to uh, participate in the liturgy of the Word and uh, the liturgy of the Eucharist, and being aware that uh, in these two uh, aspects of our liturgical celebration, you are really encountering Christ, and particularly the Eucharist, as we know, is the wh what makes the Church. To me, hands down, my favorite part during the Mass is the Communion, when I get to receive our Lord. And if you think about it, none of the Apostles ever get to be as close as us with, when we receive Communion. You know, we receive our Lord and we become one with Him. The actual elevation of the Body and Blood of Christ, I think that's the highest point for me. And then frankly also at the, uh, after receiving the communion because it's time for me to be simply grateful and to be with God, to remember that He is in me, literally in me. As priests, we need to speak more and emphasize more on the meaning of the Eucharist, you know, as the faithful people come to the church on Sunday, just take the advantage 
with a moment to preach and speak a little bit more about the meaning of the Eucharist. It boggles my mind sometimes to think that God allows himself to be present and for somebody like me to receive him. So for me, it, it just shows how loving God is to me. Um, it, it makes me want to sacrifice more because he sacrificed so much for me. Um, and I couldn't get through the week without Sunday Mass. In our Sunday Eucharist, our church is filled with young people and college students who sometimes we say, oh, they're a little cynical about their faith in the church. They come here because they hear the story and they can express their story. We have it all in the Eucharist. We can't get that anywhere else. It's just the, the truest and greatest gift that we can have and experience, and it makes us be more of a community. Mass for me is like being rooted in my faith and, and the more I go to Mass, that the more those roots like take hold in my life and the more that I realize God's love for me through the Mass and through prayer, the more my love for other people is able to bloom. If there's nothing else about the liturgy that I take away, it is that I have an opportunity with other people like me to receive Jesus in a way that no other Christian faith does. And says, Jesus becomes part of me to help make me whole, to help renew me, to change me. Th that's important. And, and that's, um, hey, it's life giving. I always come away feeling, you know, very refreshed. And I know it's something that I definitely um, wouldn't be the same person without. And so. We lost our last son. And so I think it also gives me a lot of, of peace in my heart that there is nowhere else where I can be as close to our little James as when I'm here with God. So um, I have a lot of peace and a lot of energy for that day. We're parishioners in a, in a tough neighborhood and people with tough lives and any place, <laughs> any place that you're, you're struggling with the, the difficulties of life, it's more or less what was from this past Sunday, that Jesus is the vine and we're the branches, and it's our connection to Him. Uh, and if we lose that connection, we're like cut off from the vine and we dry up and, and die. If I walk in there sad, if I walk in there um, with doubt, I've never left Mass not feeling rejuvenated. I feel like the advice that I get here, the, the family that I get here, like the feeling, I feel like I'm ready to conquer like the whole week. I'm ready to go for it and do whatever I want to achieve. There's a sense of anticipation and excitement for the week. And even sometimes often uh, I get inspired by kind of what happens here and the relationships I form. And it really kind of helps me start my week uh, on a really wonderful kind of high note of, um, of joy and gratitude and most of all love. The year of the Mass would show that how it's important that it's not just good enough to say, oh, I'm Catholic and you never go to Mass, but it says, I'm Catholic and Mass is a part of my, our identity and Mass is the part of our community that brings us together. I just hope that people will, you know, uh, take up this challenge and be able to really focus and uh, enrich their faith uh, through the liturgy of the, of the Eucharist and the Word. Every year is a year of the Sunday Mass, I suppose. It's, it's the center of what we do as a church. Uh, and it's good, I think, to underline that and pay attention to it uh, and to realize that everything else that we do is really secondary to that. <laughs>